question that the clients have asked, what is vaping? Right, what is vaping is really complicated, but there are whole generations of these apparati or these nicotine delivery devices, that's what they're called. So obviously a cigarette is a nicotine delivery device. And here's a range of what some of them look like. The more common and com current generation of these devices look a little bit like this, if you can see me holding it up. There's a pink one here, and it's called Hawaii. Some of you might have seen this one. This one is another one that's called Grape, and it's called, um, I've just dropped it, sorry. Um, it's called an I Get What One. Uh, that's about how big they are and you might realize or notice that they're not marked with any content in them at all. So these are devices that deliver nicotine in various sophisticated ways into the depths of the lungs. So not looking much like a cigarette but the idea that is that you inhale it. Thank you. So the next question Renee is how is vaping different to smoking? So the the basics um, of, of, of if there's vaping and advantages is that the advantages of over smoking is that you're not burning it or combusting any organic material. So there's no real carbon monoxide, which is a problem gas that causes many cardiovascular and vascular problems, carbon monoxide. You've heard of carbon monoxide poisoning. Um, so there is no, none of those gases. There's no tar, which is the mess that you get from um, the burning of these of leaves. There's no particulate matter. That is when you burn leaves, you're breathing in smoke, which is particles and that doesn't land in your lungs. Um, and it is a, a major motive is at the moment is that they're cheap. Compared to cigarettes, this is relatively cheap, but it is going up and I'll talk about that later, going really very high because of what's happened since the 1st of October. So the potential or the advantage might be, might be that it might reduce heart disease and it might reduce lung disease because of those con contents not being there. That might be the advantage over smoking cigarettes. Next slide. The disadvantages of, Smitra, I'm just going ahead of you, might be that because of the fact that it contains substantial substantial quantities of nicotine is that your blood pressure yours and mine would go up if you use it even if you've never used these or cigarettes or smoked your blood pressure it has a vasoconstriction it constricts your arteries so there are heart effects there are lung effects that you might have heard of and my colleague um, Matthew Peters can expand on Ivali or the pneumonia or the pneumonitis that might occur from inhaling products onto the lining of the lung like flavorings which are not meant to be inhaled. They're meant to be even not in that ingested, but not breathed in into the lungs. The effect of this addiction potential is incredibly high and very worrying. We're worried in particular about the delivery of nicotine so deep in the lung, it's actually the apparatus itself is now called a manner of fluxing, that's the term, fluxing nicotine into your bloodstream so that it's so quick, it goes so quickly to the brain, it's certainly better than surpassing nicotine nicotine that you might get from a cigarette. So that's the disadvantage to the brain is that it stimulates the brain to get these effects. There are oral effects. We know of flavorings on the and um, other products on the lining of your mouth that affect. So dentists don't like vaping either, just in case you thought it was um, not an effect. It is an effect. There is an effect of passive vaping. Somebody's asked that question before, and there are articles about that. The Lack of quality control is really interesting. I just want to quickly remind you, if you didn't know this, even the term vape has been constructed by the tobacco industry to get away from the nasty cigarette terminology to vaping, which sounds a lot more benign or safer. Vape is what? Water vapor. Well, it's not, but that's how it's made to impress people, getting away from the word cigarette. And the production of these is getting so streamlined and so efficient that that in itself has become a worry. Thank you, Renee.